Welcome once again to Screwball Gaming, FIFA 17 career mode of course. Glasgow Rangers in action today. And it's back to league duty after the disappointment of the Scottish Cup last week. Rangers need to focus once again on keeping the pressure on Celtic at the top of the table. As you can see, five point gap between the two sides. And Rangers can't afford to let that gap increase. So they will be looking for a victory here today at McDermott Park as they take on St Johnson Rangers with the best away record in the league a full 28 points taken well not full 28 points but you know what I mean 28 points taken on the road which is the best in the league so far as we take a look at St Johnson's side Tommy Wright setting out his team as you would expect it's a 4-4-2 formation Blair Olsen and Lucas in the middle of the field Santos and Hunter up top Scobie and Allen are the centre halves and Rangers once again have rotated their team today with view to that big game against Manchester United in the midweek of course in the Champions Cup Rangers have managed to reach the knockout stages and they will be hoping to go into that one free of injury and on a high so Bobby Wood partners Gomez up top Dorsch and Acosta in the middle of the park Poole and Rochella are the centre halves here today. Rangers are eager to keep the pressure on at the top of the table and make sure Celtic can take no great deal of advantage. And Gregor Melend is the man in charge of this one today. And it's Rangers to kick this one off. Here we go. This is Gerso. Early chance for Rangers. And it's just touched behind there by Blair Olsen. Rangers with an early corner. Gerso to take. Sends an outswinger in. That's touched away by the St. Johnson keeper. And Rangers looking to come forward again, but that's a slack one. It doesn't make its way to Gerso. Rangers getting away with that. And, Kelly and St. Johnson have to clear. Rangers wasteful with the throw. That's out of play for another. Something wrong with that steward there. Looked a bit shaky as a bit of a frosty day here at McDermott. Maybe he's a bit of shivering going on. As Rangers look to come forward. Costinha chasing it down. This is Bobby Wood. Well, the cross in. The keeper had to deal with that in the end. Looked like it was just coming in. Just under the crossbar. We just have the second corner of the game. Gerso again. This time it's easily held by the keeper. Big Hamilton. Here come Rangers once more. This is Gomez. Gomez looking for the run. Finds his man. And a fine finish it is. And that man is having a little bit of a career renaissance here. He didn't get off to the best of starts at Rangers, Bobby Wood, but... Well, he's really upped his game. And that is a wonderful finish. From a great little through ball. Dinked over the top from Jose Gomez. And Bobby Wood smashes it home. Starting to find his feet now as a Rangers striker, and it's the visitors who have the lead here today. 
Seven goals for Bobby Wood. And well, he's a £20 million pound striker. You may expect a greater return on that kind of investment, but Rangers fans will think it's better than nothing at the moment. Here he is again, making his way into the box. Good work from Wood. He's just unable to get the ball across in the end. And St Johnson on the rack at the moment. Rangers with the early ball in, but nobody wise to that. It will go out of play for a St Johnson throw. Edge of their own area. And it's a panicked clearance again. Rangers unable to retain, but well they do have it actually. And that's ballooned out of the park. <laughs> Quite audacious attempt there. Boofed. It's a rosette number. In fact, it looked like it did clear the stadium in the end. Rangers with the one goal lead. Just 20 minutes gone here. At McDermott Park. A very frosty, cold and chilly day. But Bobby Wood has warmed the cockles of these Rangers fans travelling here today to Perthshire and Rangers looking for some more lovely and that is a wonderful goal and this time Rangers go two goals ahead let's take a look again wonderful finish in off the post Excellent build up play from the visitors. Big Hamilton could not get down to that. And that's an excellent finish. Da Costa with the goal. Rangers in cruise control now. You would have to think. And they look in the mood for some more, but it's St Johnson in the mood at the moment to try and get back into this game. Here they are, edge of the area. Well, it's misplaced pass. The Rangers get away with one there. Now it's the Ibrox side on the attack once more. This is Bobby Wood, scorer of the opening goal. And that's just intercepted. St Johnson can clear and they're looking to build in fact. This is Santos. Well, poor ball from Santos. Rangers can relax. This is Poole. Dorsch. Mesquida. Cool play from Mesquida. Been closed down there, but well, that's given away this time. This is Dorsch. This is Gesso. Gesso vaulting the challenge. He's got plenty of space to run into here. Well, he just made the wrong decision in the end with the pass. Gerso Rangers still comfortable with this 2-0 lead the goals coming from Bobby Wood and Adrian Da Costa this is Young into the box punched away Just looking to break once more. This is Bobby Wood. He escapes the attentions of his marker. And just battling again for this ball, and they have it through Dorsch. Dorsch. Put the ball forward for Wood. Oh, 
Well, Rangers just not quite playing that attractive attacking football we saw in the opening 20 minutes or so. They failed to get out of second gear here today. They do have the goals, but fans would be expecting more. Can Rangers deliver? Here they come. Oh, that's an easily held one in the end. Bobby Wood with the attempt. Hamilton equal to that. As the half-time whistle sounds here at McDermott Park. And it's Rangers with the two-goal lead. As we go into the break. The goal's coming from Da Costa and Bobby Wood with the opener. St. Johnson now Rangers to half time. As Ward comes in, that Celtic currently drawing 1 1 in their game as St. Johnson make a change at half time. Cornish coming on as they look to change their fortunes here today. It's been pretty ineffectual so far from St. Johnson Tommy Wright will need to tweak his tactics here today if he wants to get anything from this one Rangers again on the attack he's just overrun that one Bobby Wood well Rangers can look ahead to that glamorous tie against Manchester United but there's still a job to be done here today and most of these players, of course, will not feature being the recognised B team, but who knows, you could play yourself into contention, perhaps for a slot on the bench with a good performance here today. That is a free kick to Rangers just outside the D. What can they do with this one? And that's wide in the end, a bit rushed from Bobby Wood. This is Alan, Alston, Hunter, Young, Lagermeyer, Hunter's dispossessed, Rangers with a chance to come forward, Rangers losing possession themselves, this is Gomez coming forward, can he keep that in play, well he can but can't do very much with it. Just gives it back to the St. Johnson defenders. They are happy for that gift. There's a gift given back in return. As Rangers, well, what's he doing there? That wasn't the ball he was going for at all. Rangers crowding out. St. Johnson man but the free kick is awarded and it's going to be another change here two changes in fact Dobbs and McLaren coming on for Santos and George Hunter and St. Johnson I think the final roll of the dice to try and get back in this game half an hour remaining here come Rangers once more, looking for the killer third goal. Well, they won't. They're not going to get it like that. Here they come once more. It's a nice ball through, and that one stings the palm of Big Hamilton. Bobby Wood looking for goal number two today. Scorer of the opener, of course. Rangers with the corner. Another chance to get the ball into the box. Goes far post this time, but that's easily defended. And it goes out of play for a throw in to Rangers at the halfway line. He'll be quite happy with today's work. Rangers never really looking troubled. Two early goals, settling the nerves since then this game's well failed to set the heather alight but 
Rangers won't be bothered about that. Three points, of course, all that matters. Celtic currently drawing their game. And it's another one, touched behind by Hamilton. He hasn't had too much to do today. He has lost the two goals and made a couple of saves, but Rangers not really firing on all cylinders, as they have another corner. And that one's harmlessly wide by Gomez. Time for changes. Well, Rangers will make all three changes as we're into the 70th minute here at McDermott Rangers comfortable with a two goal lead just knocking it about looking for an opportunity to come forward once more nice tackle there Easily intercepted by Pull. And that's out for the Rangers throw. Well, Rangers will know it's a different proposition entirely in the midweek when they take on Manchester United in the Champions Cup knockout stages. And that'll be a Huge game for the Ibrox club, trying to get anything out of that one. They have taken scalps of Borussia Dortmund and Barcelona this season. So, nothing to fear really, but you think it's going to be another difficult task for Rangers to get through. As we're into the last 10 minutes here. This game just petering out somewhat. It's not really been a much of an entertaining entertaining one for the fans. Not much of a spectacle, but Rangers grinding out a result here as things stand. Sometimes you do have to win ugly. That is a foul, surely, edge of the area, and it's given. Rangers have the free kick into the last five minutes here. What can they do from this one? Bobby Wood, of course, wasteful with a free kick in the first half. Let's see what Jose Gomez can do with this. And that is a peach, that is how you do it. He'll be sent to Bobby Wood after this one. Take a look at this, son. Boofed. Pick it out, Hamilton. Big Hamilton in the goals, getting nowhere near that one. And that's a fine strike from Jose Gomez. Fourteen and a half million pound man. And that's his fifth of the season for Rangers. Former Benfica striker, of course. Wonderful free kick. And Rangers very comfortable now. As this game peters out. St Johnson have not been at the races at all today. Very, very poor. Questions will be asked of Tommy Wright after this one. Rangers coming forward once more. St. Johnson managed to keep that in play. Surely the full time whistle will sound now. And 
the whistle blows here at McDermott Park. It is the away side with a huge victory here today. Comprehensive one indeed. Let's take a look at the action. It was Bobby Wood with the goal on 13 minutes. Nice work from Gomez to set him up. And a wonderful strike lashed home. And things were already looking down for St. Johnson. The misery was to continue. And it was Adrian Da Costa adding number two. In the 22nd minute, he pops up. And that is a great little finish. Left footed and off the post. Rangers cruising now. And then perhaps the icing on the cake. Josie Gomez with a late free kick. And the former Benfica man makes no mistake with that one. St. Johnson in absolute disarray. Gomez steps up. Dispatches with a plum. And those Rangers fans behind the goal. Absolutely in raptures. So this one ends here today. St. Johnson nil. Rangers 3.